Hey beauties and welcome back to I Am Beautiful Hustler TV. Today we are back with a new video and today's hair is provided by your list of hair. Now inside the, pack the packaging, of course, you get the wig, some lashes, you get a Yolissa little head wrap, silk wrap, edge brush, um, the Yolissa melt band, and of course your HD cap to do your ball cap method and the bag to keep your wig storage in. And of course you get the wig and today is a 26 inch body wave, medium size cap, HD 13 by four wig. And this is what the wig looks like for, out of the packaging y'all. It is completely ready to install. It is plucked to perfection. It has the band in the inside. The knots are bleached and plucked to perfection. And the body curls already come in the wig, y'all. So, so, so pretty. And like one of the best wigs thus far that I have received that was actually a ready to install wig. Like this wig was literally ready to install. I had to do nothing but install and style. And today I'll be using Mama Hustler for our look for today. And as you can see from the beginning of this vid video, we did some big fluffy wand curls with this hair. Because it was already curly and I never do wand curls, I was like, you know what, let me get him a wand curl look. It's been a very, 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 very long time since I did some wand curls. So that's why I decided to do a side part with some big fluffy wand curls. So for the installation part, it's the same basic installation, just adding the foundation to the lace, to the cap, and going in with my layers of adhesive. So I'm gonna go ahead and just add my adhesive layers and just spread it out with my glue spreader, um, edge brush, and just spread it out nice and thin. And I'm gonna do the same thing on both sides. And for her install, I believe I did three or four coats. Um, I can't remember, but um, I did one half at a time. So I just did one half, spread it out, and did the other side. And I did this for each excuse me y'all i did this for each of my layers but once i got all of my layers down we're gonna go ahead and uh press that lace into that glue and you guys will see how natural this wig looks before i even get into cutting the lace off and doing the baby hairs and you know the styling and stuff And you can already tell like this wig was perfect just by me laying the lace down and just blow drying it and you see how natural the hairline is like this is the perfect like wig that really you have to do nothing to it like honestly they plucked it to perfection the bleach uh, the knots were already bleached and it was already styled basically with the middle part and the body curls like this was the perfect just really throw on wig and honestly we could have really did a no baby hair look because the natural hairline was eating the grass up but you know with the style that i did i decided to just do like you know the baby hairs on both sides but this was the perfect clean hairline for a no baby hair look
and now I'm gonna go ahead and cut all of the um, extra lace from around the hairline and once I do that to both sides we will get into prepping for our styling process And do you see how natural the hairline is? I'm telling y'all, the no baby hairs would have definitely, definitely ate. It is giving fresh relaxer out the scalp with this hairline. Like, I absolutely love it. 
love 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 this wig like it did what it was supposed to do but now i'm gonna go ahead and get into the styling at first i was gonna do the middle part but i was like you know what let's let's switch it up a little bit let's switch it up a little bit so i decided to do like a side part but i'm telling you the bust down the middle would have ate if i just did like some body curls like a soft look type of it really would have ate but i was like you know what i never do one curls, so i'm gonna just go ahead create my side part and um you know prep it for the styling do me a nice little curved part you know get everything all sleeked out all around pull out the section for the baby hairs all that good stuff and then um we will get into curling up this hair So I'm, you know, created me a nice, beautiful little C curved part. So now I'm sectioning off the baby hair areas. And then once I do that on both sides, I will uh, continue to sleek up the side part area, especially in the front where that part is, because we want to get rid of that extra, um, that part in the middle line. And we're going to get that out the way, smooth everything up and, you know, uh, pull the baby hair off both sides and you know we're going to spray the hairline down with a little holding spray and then tie it down so everything is nice nice and nice neat and sleek And now I'm just taking my even spray, spraying the hairline, and then I'm going to go ahead and tie it down with the melt belt after I smooth everything on back.
Now, while I have that melt bell sitting, I am going to stop my wand curling process simply because I am using a very, very small curler. The curls are going to be small, so it's a lot. It's big and fluffy. And because wand curling with this little, tiny, little thing, it takes took a little minute okay y'all took a little minute so because I can't grab too much of a big chunk because how small the barrel is so I had to take small sections but you know it you know it worked out for the best in the end but uh once I wrapped it I just kind of squeezed it for a few seconds together so it could cool down for a little bit and then I let it go and I'm gonna wand curl the whole thing um and leave it tight but once I'm done curling up the last piece I will go in on camera and stretch the curls out and pull them apart so we could get the full volume and fullness of the hair and just look so pretty bouncy and then we're gonna smooth it all together you know groom it up nicely and y'all y'all just stay tuned because it's so pretty And this is what the whole back of the head looks like after I finish while curling it. So now I'm going to go ahead and finish up the, this side right here. Um, right here in the front where like the little bang part is. Not really a bang because I didn't cut a bang. But you know like when you want curl you smooth it out to give that bang effect. That's kind of what I did here. So I'm just going to go ahead and finish wand curling up this front area. And then we would go ahead and do the baby hairs.
So now that I finished cutting up the hair and I did the baby hairs, what we're gonna do now is go ahead and pull the curls apart to get them nice and fluffy. So I'm gonna start from the back and I'm just going to start pulling the curls apart and stretching them down, kind of like pulling them, you know, just kind of like separating them a little bit so it can really fluff out and go, you know, gets to its fullest potential. Um, because this hair is long, but you know, because I curled it with the warm curls, it looks shorter, but I'm gonna stretch it out and it's gonna get so full and pretty, y'all. Just stay tuned. Do y'all see how the curls is curling? They popping. It is so, so pretty. Absolutely love it, love it, love it, love it. So I'm gonna finish fluffing this out, you know, get it to the front, play with it, comb it, smooth it, add a little holding spray towards the top to get it to kind of like flow all together. But I absolutely love this look, so stay tuned for the finished look. And now we are fluffing out the front and just combing everything into place. So we just, you know, I'm going still by piece by piece. And that way I'm going to, you know, um, add the holding spray, create my little curve and do all of that. I don't know what we was talking about right here, y'all, but I don't know. But yeah, so we're going to go, I'm going to go ahead and fluff it out and um, prepare it to do like my little bang look towards the top. And with the top, I curled some away from the face and I curled some towards the face. And yeah, just combing it out, spreading it out, you know, not too much combing, but kind of like spread it out and just trying to get it to be kind of uniform or whatever. I got to try them Hollywood beach waves because the way I warm curl this, y'all, I feel like I could do them Hollywood waves if I just take my pins and, you know, pin it together and, you know, you know how they do it. If you don't know how they do it. I know Jordan killed this, so I got to go back and watch this video that I'm going to try because he killed them, um them hollywood waves but yeah the way i was wand curling this i feel like i could definitely do the hollywood waves because it's like with the wand curl look but pinning and all that but nevertheless y'all the curls is combed out but not too much nice and fluffed out so i'm gonna swoop this bang a little bit more into the face area but yeah stay tuned for the finished look
and I'm just going ahead and you know conceal up that part and here is the finished look just comb it up a little bit more I said mom hold on we're gonna put this in your face a little bit and you can take it out your app but here is the finished look so pretty yes 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 girl mama hustler is giving make sure y'all drop some hard ass down below period thank y'all for watching